Don't ring a bell to Pokemon go. Stadium. Love this map. Love this map. Lots of action. As we get into it here. Love to see that whip out there. Ooh, with a hammer throw right off the rip. I, I believe so. I believe so. It must be. It must be. I, again, I don't. I don't know this character as well as I do some of the others. Some heavy hitting there from Ketfeen right off the bat. Getting some. Getting some quick touches in. Lightning already having some issues. Getting on a ledge. Find himself in some trouble. Find himself in some trouble again. Gets, oh, there it goes. Life one down for Lightning. Yeah, that might be a basic. I mean, when would you go to the higher levels? Uh, this guy, uh, that air there, and that one down. It, it's one of the bigger ones. You gotta be 100% sure that you're gonna be able to go. So, uh, but, but at the same time, uh, Kyle doing a really good job at being in your face the whole time. Yeah, a key thing in this match is once you get them to that ledge, stay over top of them, ha hammer them, and keep them, keep them from coming back. But in that situation, uh, Kedfi didn't really have to do much. Like, uh, the lightning just kind of overextend themselves and really couldn't get back. And just as Kedfi jumps off again, wow, we almost had a uh, almost a suicide there by lightning uh, after he was being aggressive. Yeah, it's like cloud is gonna play now. Yeah, that's gonna be a, a tough one. He's going back into it. The second round, well, good use of the wood to get back, but that's, I mean, you're not coming back from that one, yep. so two cocks down already for Lightning. Yeah, and uh, Kenfie doing a pretty good job not letting anybody get, the, uh, get near him because uh, he's still got all his lives left. I mean, this is this is pretty impressive right now. Lightning, Lightning kind of going through it a little bit. Um, well, a little bit of offense there from Lightning that we're seeing coming back. I mean, if you can get a stock, at least, at least one. Here we go. Be, that would be better than nothing. This is, this is a better three. Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, yeah, you might be losing this one badly, but you want to just get some momentum. Exactly. For the next match. Good defense. Uh, yep, wow. absolutely. Here we go. Here we go. Little combo move there. Doing some damage. Oh, getting him on the edge. Ked Fiend saying, nope, don't come near me, brother. You are done. I thought it was going to be a life or a life. Yeah. Not even. Not even. It's like, no, I'm going to survive this. I, I, I can't just win by sacrificing myself, but I'm not going to do so. I, I'm just going to, you know, take a leap and, and get to the edge. You know, I've seen some kamikaze moves in my time <laughs> on this game for sure. But standing over an opponent as you see them dying, when you're low on health as well, that, that is a bold move. But Kedfine, he knew. He said, we're going to we're gonna finish this right now. Yeah. So we're going to be going on in the second round here in just a second. Um, congratulations to the first win of this uh, this first round. Well, they did get one more match. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, so it's still round one, uh, game two of round one. Right. Basically. Right. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, confusing. it's confusing. It is. It's hours. very confusing. Uh, but, yeah, it should be – it's probably – I'm told it's, it's the same two characters uh, that they, they had the same pick. No? Picks? Nope. Yeah, I think they're going to be changing picks up here. Okay, um, okay. Not sure. That'll be good. Okay, interesting. Let's see. Let's see who they choose uh, now for the second one. Um, Cloud. I mean, how are you not going to pick Cloud I mean, after being so dominant? Or maybe, maybe you feel so so good about yourself that. Yeah. <laughs> Lightning. 
Pretty impressive uh, uh, situation there. So as impressive as seeing a cassette player in 2024. Well, I think we did that because the cassette player and this game might have come out around the same time. This is an old game, and I love every minute of it. You say new game, the same time? It's, uh, not the same time, <laughs> but mean, it's it. you would see people walking around, <laughs> boombox on the shoulder. Okay, okay gotcha. Same gotcha. time, we're going home. We're playing Super <laughs> gotcha. Smash. Okay, okay. So um, nice to see it uh, being played by some high schoolers here, learning some talents. And um, truly a game that uh, some of us old heads really enjoy. So, uh, cool. good good round one there. Um, Going to see uh, what we got coming up next here in round two of this match against Inlo versus Leesville. Um, so, I believe Inlo took round one, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and so, let's see what uh, round two has an offer uh, for uh, for this next match. Yeah. We should be seeing Joker. I believe we're going to see Pyra. Yep, Pyra Mithra versus Joker. Gonna be choosing to see which character, how they're gonna. How they're Three, gonna two, one, go! <laughs> Left here. 
bumping those numbers up. Hell is pumping up the damage right now. I'm right here. I'm really taking the school. Um, Mech's trying to get his big brother to stay in the air. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Is Ooh, that captain? I like that idea. No? I yes. like the Captain Falcon idea. <laughs> Takes me back to the old days, so. Oh, we're getting word here. Okay, a little bit of a rule change. A little bit of a rule change. Inlow wins that match versus Leesville. They only needed two to win. They got the two. Um, congratulations to Inlow on that win. Um, so, great Great match mm -hmm. for both teams, but honestly, Inlow they they kind of showed them how to do uh, how to play Super Smash Brothers. A they bit they there. did. They definitely so, did. So I think we're going to roll into the next round here. I think we've got our next games queuing up. Uh, Panther Creek versus Green Level, um, same area, Wake County, going to be a head to head match, um, and we've got three rounds of this one uh, as well. It's going to be uh, three different players, I believe, uh, or for each team. Um, playing a best of three games. So we'll see where this one takes us here as we get ready for this uh, first match. All right. Where do you see the action? There's just a lot of weight. Dan versus Cassia. Sensei uh, Boa versus I haven't seen this one. I have seen a, you know, a little bit of a, a, a match action back on the, on the latest uh, States final that we had. Uh huh. Don't go with it. That was a fair match. Well, here's what you need to know about Ness. If Ness brings that bat out, you better watch out. Is he swinging for the fences? He reminds me, if for my other old heads out there, he reminds me of Pablo from Backyard Baseball. He loves to swing that bat, and when he does, you better watch out. There it is. Like I said, calling it right off the bat. Give me that Pablo Ness, and boom! Going up, going up already in this first round here. Um, Sinsaboa and Pradish. Sinsaboa and Pradish. Um, he, God, I love seeing that. He combos really well. I mean, the, the, the combos that he's putting on other bodies are also really good. The thing with, uh, with Casper is, is he's a very heavy hitter. So if he can land one of those overcuts, he's going to be a good guy. Yeah. Oh, he hasn't been able to land it. I mean, he's, he has a uh, like laser beam on uh, the release game. But Sensei Moai has been very good at giving very short distance. That's how he wants to play against Casper. And all of a sudden, I mean, two stocks down. Wow, we he's back this week, what, three and a half maybe? Yeah, we are we are flying for this one. Ness is making short work as we say that. Uh, Cassia tries to take Ness out the match, get him a stock down. There it is. There it is. Back to 2-1. Feeling a little bit better about themselves, saying, all right, let's regroup. We're not doing too bad, but cannot let him come back uh, heavy out of this, uh, this first little big. We don't want stock left. He's hitting and every time he touches uh, Cassidy, yeah, it's like 20% more up or more. So, here, we're there. Yeah, I say is this that, it? You know? Look at that. Not quite. Still fighting. This might be it right here. Following down, saying you're not getting back on that ledge. I'm in this game right now. Since the bow with that first round win in this, uh, in this first bout, I guess you could say, between the little baseballer. The little baseballer. Love to see that first round win there for Ness. Uh, so congratulations to them. And uh, we're going to get ready to roll into round two here right now. Um, not could, rolling these things quick. We want action at all times. We don't want to stop. We want to go, go, go. So <laughs> we're uh, we're rolling into this next round here. Um, going back to Pokemon Stadium. You, you said a uh, little baseballer, but it seems like a little bully, you know, to me. He, he <laughs> might be a little bully. He <laughs> might be more of a Barry Bond situation because he's got a big <laughs> stick and he is swinging that thing. Dude. So here we go. Uh, looks like we're getting a little bit of a switch here. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> yeah, looks like we got Turtle versus Lava. Uh, lava using Ness. Yeah. Uh, 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 
down right now. Yeah, and it looks like uh, Mo's a little bit faster in his attacks, but I guess he's kind of building up as he's going to do it. And it's working out right now for Mo. Mo is uh, taking it to Ness a little bit. So, a little part of my heart's breaking right now, but it's all right. I, I know how strong Ness is. Ness will come back. Get a win already, Mo. Yeah. That on the screen here? Okay, okay. Yeah. 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 Saw the little baseballer. He still got another chance. He got sent to the bench. He got I, sent to the bench. He, he'll be back playing. Don't I hope so. It. No, no. Coach. I, I hope so because um, I love seeing him out there. We, we, we saw the fighting spirit there. I mean, coach, you just put it back there. It, yeah. It's not done. It's not done. So how are we feeling after seeing these first couple rounds? You, you, you lean in anybody's way? Uh, you you know, character that you're that particularly like to see? I know we saw Ness twice there. Who, who would you like to be if you were in a tournament in a situation like this? Look, I, I'm a I'm a Tekken guy, kind okay. of. A, you know, I, I like Cassidy, but I, I've seen done better. You know, before you know, he's he's gonna be more timely, and it, it's tough because he's not the fast a pace a player. But I, I like it whenever he hits, he hits hard. You know, and he puts you out. You know, some 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 characters they have trouble like getting the finish. Mm -hmm. He they they get to 150. And, and you keep racking uh, damage and damage and damage. Right. You get to 100% and still not getting the person out. Cassie, right. yeah, that's not the case. Right. However, you know, a little bit slower, but I like it. Um, uh, if for what me, would, yeah, what would you? for me personally, I, I'm an old school guy. Mm -hmm. So I know there's about 82 characters in this new yeah, game yeah, now. Yeah. Give me the first 30, 40 of the first one. Give me <laughs> anybody from there. Link, uh, Diddy Kang, Diddy Kang um, you know, any of those mid-tier heavy hitters. But I really like people who are mobile because I tend to fall off the map, and I like to be able to get back. So anybody that can get me back, I am a fan of. So um, that's what that's the kind of team I'm looking to play with or person I'm looking to play with as we get ready for this uh, next match to see who, uh, who exactly is going to be taking home a victory here tonight. So we're going to be rolling into game three here. Um, and this is going to be, again, with Green Level and Panther Creek. We're, we're, we're back to Sensei Boa. I'm proud of you. Yeah. Three, so this is going to be two, game three. One, go! Sensei Boa and Proud of you are against each other. We're going to see Ness. We're also Terry, right? Yeah. Terry. Out of here. First round win there for uh, 
Looking for Ness, getting the stocks out of the way. Love to see it. Love to see it first. There by Pradish. Very good effort there. Uh, almost got back to the win. Just like I called earlier. Little baseballer. Yeah. Hitting yeah, him yeah. out of there, baby. Love to yeah. see that. Love to see Ness taking a W. Again, I don't have an affinity for either school. I just like characters. You know, <laughs> give me them old school guys. Give me those guys that I used to play with when I was growing up and let me see them take home a W because that's what we're here for. And we're here to have fun because this is fun. True, I'm true, enjoying true. every bit of this. Well, that's the core of a Smash, to be honest with you. This is a game that shouldn't be, like, competitive at all. It, it should be, like, having fun and with right. your friends. And that's it. But, I mean, you know, hardcore people, they, they make it, they make it uh, competitive uh, in one way or no another. Just like we have a, a slant here, you know, like making things up. Uh, it, it seems like it's going to fall down, but I don't know if somehow uh, it holds. I mean, the amount of Doritos and Capri Suns <laughs> and Hot Pockets <laughs> and uh, Tostito pizza rolls that I've eaten playing this game with all of my friends and my mom sitting there yelling at me, stop yelling, you're waking me and dad up, it's 1 o'clock in the morning, you all need to be quiet and go to bed uh -huh. soon. And I look around and say, Mom. I got Super Smash to play, and we still got Doritos here. We're going to keep going. So um, I apologize to all the uh, controllers that I've ruined over the years. So we're going to get ready to go to Game 5 here right now. Uh, we'll get with Ben Krieger. With Terry and Ness once again. Uh, 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 just a little bit right now. Here's a 
quite finish it there. Good defense there. Oh. Oh. Puts him on the ropes. finish it off for Panther Creek and Terry. I'm not sure. I can't remember the count. I believe that's correct, though. I, I think so, yeah. Um, it, it was it was tough for Pradish because getting away from that lightning, it, it proved to be a full-time job. You know, it's like every yeah. single time that you go in the air, there's Ness once more, you know, with the lightning. And sometimes he did. He managed to get out of the way. But the times he didn't, it, it cost him barely. It was, it was too much damage out of the time. And then I think twice – or maybe more than twice, he lost stocks out of that lightning. Okay. Well, I'm getting told that that is not the end of it. We got a couple more rounds here. So we're going to get rolling here right again with, uh, I guess, round six. Um, as we go, we're going to see uh, what players we got here. Uh, it looks like, is that Chrome versus, nope, this is going to be Corinne versus Pyra. Myth. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, this is Lava and Turtle. So now we're going to have Lava and Turtle here with. Uh, But uh, already as we get into it, Lava having quite a bit of time on Turtle. Turtle already 135. As you said, anytime you use red numbers, you better hang on. And there we go. Losing the stock for Turtle there. Uh, going down a stock. Coming right back with the minions. Almost oversteps and falls out. We know you're the world. Here we go, Lava Turtle, 
setting up a final round. Wow. So that's it. That's it. No. For it. Win. I win. Sound, but I think it was a one-to-one -one match on on that series. Yeah, I mean, but but again, that was a well-fought game. It's not, you know, some of those early games we watched. It was it was a quick, you know, one hitter. Call it a day. We'll see you later. Mm -hmm. It's um, these are well-fought matches. Starting to play a little bit more defense and and not just getting overly aggressive. And um, it's really nice seeing uh, seeing both Panther Creek and Green Level go at it um, here as we. I believe we got one last match to finish this off um, with Panther Creek versus Green Level. Gonna get that rolling for you. Two, one, one go. Right there, congratulations! That was surprise. I was not ready for that. No turtle wasn't even it wasn't even red. damaged. It was a red. It was a guy, yellowish maybe. So they must have hit something that was perfect. Wow! Um, I didn't see it. I wasn't paying that close of attention to that situation. They hit a combo and bam, just like that. This match is over. That's me. I mean, that's me. I'm 70 percent. I'm dying. Uh, yeah. It's like it yeah. Happens, it happens so often. But anyways, I mean, GG's there to lava. I mean, getting everyone off guard. Um, probably a lot of people didn't think it was going to happen that way. But right. Man, I mean, kudos to you. I Congratulations. Mean, you Great round there for uh, for Panther Creek. I believe they walk away with a victory there, uh, Panther Creek. And uh, we're going to be seeing Panther Creek coming into action here again. They're going to give them a break, let them get some water just for a second, and we're going to be rolling into a couple games here from Panther Creek and Holly Springs. Holly Springs out in the Raleigh area. I know these football teams. I don't know the schools as well for the uh, for the esports, but Panther Creek put on a show, and both teams are put on a show. And I've been excited. Well, I'm just excited watching Super Smash Bros. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've talked about it. Definitely. Takes me back to my basement. Takes me back to watching and having a great time with my buddies in the neighborhood. Just saying, hey, let's go stay on a Friday night, and uh, you know, just be in each other's houses, eat your parents' food, mm -hmm. you know, drink water and juices and Gatorades, and just just have a good time. Definitely. And that's what we're doing tonight. We're having a good time. Yep, and people in the chat, you know, if, if you want to say anything, go ahead. We're we're reading it, you know. We're we're gonna be we're gonna be there uh, checking it out. So don't don't be shy. Uh, get the action. And also, there's more action you're watching right now. Wake, uh, 
the, the action for Wake here, but there's action, you know, for the other uh, conferences as well. So you got CMS, I believe, is one I of the conferences so. out so there. Um, I think there's another one or two, but just check it all out on Vessel GG at YouTube. Um, we're going to have all kinds of live stuff going here for the next couple hours. Again, last night we were running um, – Valorant, Valorant, the yep. game that I am learning. So you're gonna have to give me that one tonight. We're running Super Smash Brothers, and then tomorrow night, my night, my favorite night, Rocket League, baby, soccer with cars, high flying action, hitting balls in the air. I love to see it. So, but tonight we're gonna finish up with this Super Smash Brothers. Got a couple more games, but again, if there's any other conferences you want to see, or maybe a school you want to see, let us know in the chat. Talk to us. Let us uh, let us see if we can't figure something out for you guys. And if you miss anything, everything is gonna be here on YouTube afterwards. So yeah. So if you don't see it today. Or, I mean, you're busy watching some other conference, you can go back into the VOD and, and see anything else that you missed here on YouTube. So, I think we're ready for the. I think we're getting ready for get, it. Yep. Getting ready, getting ready. Not, not ready yet. Not, not quite ready. ready. Still waiting on uh, a couple of water bottles, I guess. That's okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, I mean, Panther Creek just played. So yeah. Let's yeah. Just give them a chance. A little, little timeout, quick timeout. Yeah. Say, hey, we got to get. Uh, my hands are sweating here. My hands are sweating. <laughs> I got to wipe them off, do something. You know, get, I'm getting the controller all clammy. And if I've been eating Doritos, now it's getting it's turning into a paste, and that's not good. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. All right, we're gonna take yeah, a quick break here. Uh, seems like a little technical thing, so we're gonna take just a quick break. Um, we'll be right back here in just a few minutes, no big deal, for some more North Carolina high school action out of Wake County. Thank you guys for watching. Let us know in the comments what else you want to see.
I'm not going to sit here and try to do it. I don't do decimals and I don't do acronyms, so we're going to go there. We, we, we learned the decimal part yesterday. So exactly, we're, we're exactly. Learning, we're, we're, we're getting to know you. you exactly. Know, a bit more every single time. So, yeah, let, let's go into the action. We, we just saw uh, Panther Creek uh, play before, so they, they were doing their, their thing. You know, they, they were doing some damage. Well, we're going to see Turtle once again here on the on the action. So, I'm excited about it. He's coming off a win uh, so far. An impressive win at it. But Havoc says, dude, I mean, you might have looked good. I'm going to use it to think Three, Exactly. It's two, almost like he's looking in the mirror one, saying Holly Springs, go. Panther Creek, Turtle, Havoc. There's not, there's a bunch of differences there, but the only difference on the stage right here is the people that are playing behind him. Keeping it tied up early. Turtle having some hits. Might be warmed up a little bit. Havoc say, sitting there saying, yeah, you just played a game, but I'm going to come in here and I'm going to show you how to play uh, this Chrome character. Again, I don't know a ton about Chrome because he's one of the newer characters. I just never selected him. Oh, no. Well, I mean, this might sway you. I mean, I like a good sword fighter. I mean, that's that has that, no issues there. Don't get me wrong. So it's just, it, it, you know, when I when I see certain characters sitting there, it's tough for me to go to some of those guys. But it, maybe maybe this is gonna allow me to say, hey, I'm this guy plays. As Havoc takes it to Turtle, round one of this, or excuse me, round. Uh, well, yeah, round one here with uh, one stock gone for Turtle already, thanks to the Havoc Super Slam. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I mean, I'm not sure he was able to get that one. I mean, go turtle now. Said, I mean, you get the first talk, right? and that's probably the only thing you're gonna get uh, right now because uh, I'm gonna unleash the fury on you. He's uh, he's not doing a lot of damage, uh, but little by little, he is getting there. And not getting hit is big. Exactly. Yeah. Not not getting hit. There was about 20 seconds there where turtle hadn't got touched, and uh, havoc was seeing uh, seeing some stars there for a little bit. But havoc coming back a little bit on turtle, getting some. Quick hits in here and there, um, and again, yeah, Havoc overstep there. Turtle turns around and, and uh, counters, and uh, Turtle's going to send Havoc on, losing one of his stocks, tied up 2-2 with uh, I was going to say, Turtle's not looking so fresh. He, he's been warm up already, but uh, Havoc is a different base. Yeah. He is a different beast, yeah, completely. Yeah, right as I said, they tied it up. Havoc sending Turtle to the Shadow Realm saying, hey, I'm going to take one of those stocks. Yeah, you might have gotten me right there, but I'm going to go ahead and finish you off here. Let you have one and sit there and think about it. Um, as, I, as he stands over him there, that is the ball game. Havoc wreaking havoc. Is that a dad joke, baby? Havoc wreaking havoc with Chrome over Turtle. It's kind of demoralizing right there, knowing that you both have the same character. It's kind of saying, guess what, bud? There's no difference between the two of us. Who's the better player? Yeah, you, Havoc showing that he was the better player in that particular round of Turtle. There's no excuses there, right? It's like, hey, we got the same weaknesses and same strength. It's about the, the player right now. He's, he's the one behind the console who's going to pull up the, the extra punches and, and show that he's the better player. So, yeah, Havoc, I mean, get him – Getting strong like right from the get go because right. because he he might be might be cold. Uh, it lasted like twenty seconds. That's it. Right. You know that's that's all it lasted. After that, it was all business. Yeah, uh, there for a second I thought Turtle was playing really well and, and he wasn't getting damaged. Just lost a stock, no damage taken. Uh, you know we're gonna turn this around. Turtle's gonna come back and, and win this game. But Havoc said, I don't know what you're thinking about. I'm gonna go <laughs> ahead and finish this off. So we're gonna get rolling here in the next round. Um, Again, uh, see who they're selecting as we go with and Ooh, change. Holly Springs. We've got a little bit of a change with Ganondorf um, for Turtle. Three, sticking two, with sticking with what one, he does. This is go. super weird because Ganondorf is one of those characters that is super heavy, super slow. And my wife, you know, tier these people put it like right on the bottom. Yeah, they uh, tier these and a. Well, I'll be honest with you, I remember a little story about the tortoise and the hare, and the tortoise was put last by everybody else, too. And who won that race? As you see Turtle here hanging in with Hattie, using that same character. I don't know, I like the other dog in fights. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what the man and dog is gonna do here with Turtle and Hattie. As I say that, Looks like that's what's, uh, what's happening. But hey, he's got some good damage on Havoc. Couple, couple hits here and he can get a little bit of a fight. 
you watch the movie. That's what I saw you do. They get there with the point here, they get the point here. I don't know if that's going to be able to do so. However, his edge guard is good. He's working hammer. He's doing some mistakes and getting more. Fight back. Hey, look, I might be an underdog, but I'm not going down by the fight. Unfortunate. As you see, devastation on my face. I really, I was rooting for that underdog. I wanted him to win, and he gave it a good effort. But unfortunately, Chrome was just in, uh, too much for him there at the end. Although I'm not mad because he was able to, you know, get things that close with a character that is usually not that favorable. Uh, going with Ganon, so uh, I, I question his decision to actually go to Ganon, and he proved that it wasn't that awful of a decision. Well, as we know in the story of the tur tortoise and the hare. Mm -hmm. There's a third character in that. It is. Yeah. There, there is. It's called uh, the the guy who likes to eat turtles. And in that situation, his <laughs> name's Chrome. Uh, Chrome came through, huh. scooped up the turtle, and said, you're out of there, uh, brother. I'm going to finish this off. I'm going to take off to the finish line and win uh, that ball game. I'm not even going to ask who was reading you the, the That was turtle. in my head. I yeah, made that uh, one. That was all in my head there. That I, came <laughs> off the cuff. Yeah. So, it is what it is. But uh, congratulations there um, to, I believe, was that Panther Creek there getting that first, uh, no, first no, win? No, Turtle is from Panther Creek. Turtle is Panther Creek. Excuse I me, think, Holly Springs. So uh, congratulations there. We're going to roll into this next round, uh, round two for the Panther Creek versus Holly Springs match. Little Mac. Huh? Little huh. Mac versus Kazoya. That is something different. Three, two, one, go! Yeah. 
He's like, all right, man, get me out of here. Get uh, some all they're taking. I don't, I don't want to be here. Yeah, he that's it. With the wing, Ball with game. The wings, like, no, I'm out. I'm out. Ben Jammin. It's not oh, Benjamin. Ben Jammin. Great job there. Great win for Little Mac, Ben Jammin, and Holly Springs there, showing us how to get it done with the hoo, 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 hoo. One, two, maybe an uppercut to finish the ball game. Love to see that. So is a is a B E E N jamming? No. Like he's been jamming. He's not bean jamming. It's been jamming because he just put him in a blender <laughs> and said, go. "I like to see my guys on the floor with my uppercut. See you later." I'm excited. Love to. See, I love seeing that. I love just the action that we got from these teams. Really, um, just. The different moves that we're seeing with the uppercut. I mean, you know, swords are fighting, but just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Yeah. Good old-fashioned yeah, fisticuffs yeah, 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 will yeah. get the job done. So we're going to get rolling here in this next match. Um, Little Mac, dude. Little I believe Mac. it's Little Mac. Um, wow. Little Mac again. <laughs> yes, it is. Change? Little yeah. Mac versus Terry. Well, older older Ash Ketchum. Older uh, Ash uh, Ketchum. Uh, Blonde Ash Ketchum. Two. Blonde Ash Ketchum. One. Go. Yeah, from yes. college. Right, he doesn't, but years. So, a little bit of a tangent there. That's uh, some nostalgia for us. We ended this round two between Holly Springs and Van Der Creek and Big Jammin and Brad. Big Jammin again going to Brad is switching up saying, Brad, I told Terry. Uh, they both fall, lose his stock, quick trade, back to zeros, reset, call it a good call it a uh, game. You know, it happens, but it's not that. It's like, you know, we're both in five bands, 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 we're both Big Jammin getting a quick combo for him right on the edge there. Radish just couldn't get back. Just like he again. Hits him with another quick combo for Radish this time. Instead of grabbing him, he comes back and says, No, I'm going to attack him. He's right in the face. Right the face. Look out. Big Jammin sending him out of there. That, that was fast. Nice work, man. Got it all figured out. Damn, you know, Damage, but he is hitting you back with that uh, straight hand, and and he did it, you know, counter after counter after counter until it was time to say good night. I mean, that, that's it, Pradesh. You're going bad early tonight, I, I guess. That's it. Congratulations there to Holly Springs, getting that quick Ooh. victory. As we uh, as we're going to be rolling here into this next match, um, I think. Yep, we've got one final match here tonight with Wake Youth versus. Raleigh? Is that correct? Uh, yeah, Wake Youth Leadership uh, against Raleigh. Okay. Wake, Wake's uh, name is much longer than that. Uh, I, I think yeah, there's, like there's acronym. Again, I don't do acronyms. Decimals, acronyms, not for me. So, so Wake sorry. Youth. Wake Youth. That, that's <laughs> so here we go. We're going to get rolling into this first, first match here. Yeah, see, WMLA, Wake Youth MLA. We'll go with that. It's, As it's we like see Bowser and Ice Climbers. I love this. These are old school characters showing you guys how it's done. The big man, the big turtle, Bowser. By the way, the name of the of the player is Armadillo. Oh, using a Bowser. I'm I love I'm that. This is fantastic. I don't know what's gonna happen in this match, but boy, oh boy, do I love that. This is this is my favorite guy all night. Bowser, Armadillo, they're all the same thing, basically. One's got spikes, one doesn't. <laughs> wow, the, the Ice Climbers, I mean, the, these guys are all over Bowser. Well, winter's coming. Winter is coming, and these Ice Climbers are showing you guys, hey, just because you got a shell and some fire doesn't mean anything. We got picks. We will throw you out the gym. We got these little sledgehammers that we're going to hit you every single time you come. How about some ice to the face? A couple quick hits there. Ice Climber is going to be one or two shots away from sending Bowser to the shadow round here in this first one. As Ooh. Bowser says, eat this, sit on my shell, I'm out of here. You are going to the shadow round, losing a stock right off the rip. It's like he's on phase by those hammers. I mean, as I say that, finally they, they get one good hit and send him off the of the platform. Yeah, but how impressive there for Bowser to have that reset. I mean, they only had 60 to 70% damage. 
but they come back, sits on his face like that, and boom, they're gone. These are all I was telling you before, like some characters, they do rack up a lot of damage, but then again, when, when it's time to get that final hit and get you out of the way, get the KO, they, they struggle with it. And Bowser is very heavy, so it's a little bit more difficult for these smaller characters to get the KO off him. Yeah, that time, hitting the, uh, hitting the old shell to the face there a little bit early, getting some damage to him, but Bowser uh, taking some hits early here from the two twins with wooden mouths. There they go, hitting him, not letting him get to the ground, not letting him reset. He tries to apply a little defense, catches a hold Ooh. of him, sends them out of there as they crawl to the edge. But they come back with a little bit of vintage there on Bowser, and there he goes into Mordor. So it's one stock left for Bowser, two for the Ice Climbers. Let's see how they can finish this out. Well, the Ice Climbers are very close to actually losing that second stock. And if, if Bowser is able to do so, he's going to even take out quite a bit. Uh, no luck there. He's going to grab and go, and that might be in no way. I mean, Monster D just getting back. I mean, it's just like nothing. Finally getting one out of the way. I, I actually have to get both of them? Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's one of the things about it. They've got a lot of movement speed. He's got to get both of them, but that second one is really easy. All you got to do is really just land a combo or, or maybe something that's a heavy hitter. They'll get out of there for you. So Bowser coming back. One stock left for each player. Got a little bit of damage. Got to play some defense as you see the shells go up and see if he can't get a hold of them as the ice picks grab him and toss him to the ground. Great defense there as the Ice Pigs try to throw a little ice this way. Bowser being a little bit predictable because he's doing the same thing over and over. You know, yep. he, he's he, you know trying to hit once, then he covers, and then you know he's getting grabbed them because they, they can't. And when he jumps, everything he does is slam down, slam down, slam down. So right now, Monster D is, is actually tired of the same thing over and over, and he just said, "Okay, man, this is this is it. You're getting boring. So good night." That is so. That is so unfortunate, but that is Super Smash Brothers. You've got two little twins with ice picks and hammers going up against a giant spiked turtle, and the turtle loses. The turtle loses against two little people with hammers, if you, wooden hammers. If you want to go more in depth, it's a kind of like a dragon. Uh, you know, he's a turtle, but he's uh, actually breathing fire and everything else. Hey, and just like in Game of Thrones... We saw who won that battle. Well, I didn't see it. Well, so you told me. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna ruin it or spoil nah, it for you because it's one of the best you series. Completely, you can but completely do congratulations it. to the ice pickers there from I believe that was Raleigh so, that uh, the ice pickers were from. I, I couldn't tell. Uh, my bad on that one. It's okay. No, I we, I, we, I we think that take. was what the graphic. Our yeah, graphics uh, have been a little off this time. Nobody's fault in the back. It's just the way the files came in. They're a little bit uh, a little bit but, rough. So. But it's it's funny that we're having like a theme here because we had you know Little Mac doing the boxing, doing the Rocky. You mentioned Rocky before, I and did. now and now we have the cliffhanger. Yep. We, we we get we get the the ice ice climber. So you know, remember a cliffhanger? Let you me see if I can make a prediction. Go ahead. I think we're going to see some form of turtle. Uh huh. Because we've seen turtles and there was a player turtle. That's the only way I'm going there. And the other thing, I think we're going to see somebody with a sword. Somebody oh. with a sword. I oh. don't know. Okay. That's okay. a, a broad prediction. Okay. <laughs> we've okay. got turtles. There's a few of those. And a sword. So but, that's what so we're going to see as we roll into this next round. Leonardo. Could be. That's Very well say. could okay. be. Okay. This Very is... well could be. He's got two swords, doesn't he? Wrong game, but yes. Okay. Well. <laughs> I mean, that just covers all bases. If Leonardo <laughs> pops out here with swords and a turtle, go ahead. I am a magician. I am the genie. Call it whatever you want to call it. But that is the prediction of the world right there if Leonardo comes on here. Okay. I, don't, I don't think Leonardo's in this game. I don't, I don't think so. Yeah, it's all right. So. But it would have yeah, been cool, yeah. though. I think we're yeah. going to roll into this last match here um, between Wake uh, Youth and uh, Raleigh. Let's see what we got. Let's see if you're right. That, that's that's what I'm trying. Yeah, I'm telling you. No swords. No swords, but the turtle is back. Why? Because two, it's the same one, two people. Go. Armadillo coming back with the turtle. And Mustard is saying, hey, if you like what you saw last time, well, guess what? I'll get By the way, Well, you say that right as he right as he sits on top of it. 
Sancho. No. And he does it and goes off the map. Oh, my goodness. Big mistake there from Armadillo. That is unreal. Uh, as he throws him in, he, he evens it up, but he did not have to lose that life. That is unfortunate. Don't worry. I've been there. I've done that a time. Brian sat down or stood down. and everything else to, to get the Bowser. You know, I'm upset. I'm, it's unfortunate for the for the big guy community out there. You know, Bowser's, he's like a mascot of mine. It's the big guy community. Gotcha, gotcha. We love him. Donkey Kong, Wario, all those guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. But unfortunately, in this scenario, he didn't prevail. But that's okay. Why? Because there was two old school people <laughs> on the screen, and I love to see that. So I'm loving to see these young guys utilizing those characters from the, we don't need that new stuff. We don't need 82 people. We need the first 40 that we gave originally. Okay. Let's pull those up there. Let's have a battle. Let's see who's going to win. So great job there for, for the Ice Climbers, and I believe Raleigh getting that W. We're going to go to round two here between Wake Youth and Raleigh uh, as soon as we can get that rolling here in just a second. And it looks like we've got a couple more of those old school players. And that's what I'm seeing. Toon League. Versus Ike. Man, oh man. South Raleigh with the lead. Three, Love two, to see it. Both one, school players. We got go. IO and Toon League and D Mac XXXXLL. So four X's and two L's. Well, there is. Check the back of my shirt, I promise. Check the back of my shirt, I promise there's bigger than four X's. Here we go. Let's so get this round. <laughs> Uh, no, it doesn't have two L's, but it's an L if you have more than four X's. Trust me on that one. Shout out to my wife. Thanks, baby. All right, so here we go into this round. We're at uh, 65 60% already here for Ike. Now, Ike is in the
the ball game. Toon Link takes this first. Toon Link wins! So as soon as he lands, he goes with the explosion, and then, you know, he's able to hit Ike from behind and get that win. So very, very well done, that uh, recovery from the edge towards the center of the platform, and then getting the win. So nice one on Toon Link. Uh, Ike, though, he... I mean, he gave a free one. He he was holding on the edge, and for some reason, he just dropped down and, and gave uh, a life away. So, it stuck away. So, I think things might be a bit closer on game number two. Yeah, yeah, we might uh, might see some closer action here. As we're going to be rolling into this final match here, um, well, is th this is the last match of the night for us, but we're going to see what else we've got uh, available here at VESLGG. Let's go ahead and roll it here. See what we've got with South Raleigh. Huh. Yeah. Is that another? I can't. <laughs> Captain Falcon. Go. Now that was a call a lot earlier. I did say Captain a long time earlier. But Captain Falcon shows up on the screen. Some people might call me a position or a I don't know. This is that just me. A few numbers. 7, 10, 11, 12, 32, and 7. That means absolutely nothing. I just gave you something. Uh, <laughs> yeah. For the lottery, you owe me 10%. Here we go. All right, so two links get right back to it. Already getting rid of one of their stages. That's it, folks. That is the ball game Toon right Link there. Win. Toon Link showing us how it's done. Fantastic Fryo. stuff. Fry was like a wave. Yeah. You know, he, he keeps moving and then brings you back and, and you know drowns you a little bit more and pulls you back. And he's like, dude, okay, I, I'm, I'm down here. I, I'm up to my head with water. What do I do? It's like, I give up. You know, it, there's not much that you can do. Captain Absolutely. Falcon, you tried, man. I mean, you, you you had him. It was like a one Falcon punch, and he's out of one stock, but never landed. Yeah. Well, it was a great night. We had a bunch of good bat matches from Wake County. We appreciate everybody tuning in. Again, if you uh, want to see more action, go to VESLGG, YouTube.com. You're going to be able to see other counties, other, uh, other events, past stuff that we've done. Um, it's going to be good stuff. And, again, tomorrow night, mm -hmm. same time, same place. Same two people, I think, yeah. going to be doing some Rocket League. Cannot wait for that. Love to see soccer with cars. Final thoughts for this evening. No, it's going uh, to be great tomorrow. It's going to be awesome. I have seen a lot of uh, Rocket League here from the schools uh, on Vessel before, and, and they were good. We, I mean, the finals, if you can if you can get a catch a clip of the finals that we saw on stage, that was phenomenal. Yeah, phenomenal. Rocket, Rocket League's been around for a little bit, not quite as long as, obviously, uh, uh, <laughs> Super Smash Brothers, obviously. but Rocket League really caught fire. So I'm excited to see what these young guys can do because uh, Rocket League's one of those where if you know how to control your car in the air, you can really finish it off. Mm -hmm. So... Be excited for that tomorrow night. Again, 5 o'clock. We're going to be starting this thing off um, fresh here with T-Fresh. We'll see you tomorrow.